Okay, guys. So, this is for you guys that like to do bubbles, like make cool bubbles. I know what a great recipe, and I tried it, and my bathtub was filled with bubbles. Like, my body, when I got out, it was good until there was soap everywhere. You just, just follow these steps. I'm going to get my can right here to fill it up. The ingredients we will be needing are a bathtub that I actually cleaned because I put soap in this. I'll show you how you do it. So you're going to need this. This is to see here, if you can see the exact same thing. If you have this, good. Get a sink, hot water. Get, one second, I just need it. Look for Okay. So you, then you need to get toilet paper, of course, a bathtub, and a container. Doesn't look like a lot, but I'll show you. So the first thing that you actually do is put a little bit in there. All right, I think that's good. Shake it around a little bit. You're good about that, okay? Then you're gonna take this, put hot water on, and put it Put it to full maximum, and you're going to keep it in there for five seconds, and then take the tube out. One, two, three, four, five. All right, you're good. I'll have some bubbles. We mix this bubbles. It gets bubbly. So. One's not over yet. Next thing that you have to do, this is for your bathtub. You're gonna clean your bathtub. So when you take the bath, the bubbles come right out, right away. You take your soap, get a paper towel, fill it with soap. Fill it, I'm talking about fill it, okay? Get some on your hand too. Make sure it's all slimy. And then you're gonna go like this, same motion. So it gets all soapy. After you do that, you get every side and every thing in the bathroom. Okay? So I'm about to do it right now. Well, not right now. That's going to take too long. But that's one of the things you have to do. Pause the video here if you need time to do that. Also, by the way, you don't need this soap. Just get a soap that's like very, like this after you shake it. Like when you go like this, it kind of looks like this. That's like the soap that's really thick, thick soap. Okay, now that you did that, we are going to about to put another ingredient inside of here. And I didn't tell you about this ingredient. It's a soap bar and your hands are all soapy. So you're gonna fill that soap bar with different soaps. You're gonna lift it, you're gonna put it in here just for a little bit. After you do that, just wash your hands with hot water. Tell you why hot water in a second. Okay, after you do that, 
Get this for three seconds inside with soap. One, two, three. That's good. Okay, now that you did that, you are going to take your shampoo right here, right? And you're gonna squirt it all over the bathtub. And you're gonna use your little paper towel and slide it around. So right when you turn on that water, there's gonna be bubbles. Okay, next what you're gonna do, since you have the soap in here, shake it, shake it, not too hard. Get the soap out safely, quickly, so you don't get that much bubbles on there. All right, perfect. So after I did that, you know what I'm gonna do next? Okay, all right. Pause the video here, so, so yeah. Uh, we're gonna be cleaning inside of here. So, now that you did that, put this inside real quick. Squirt it a few times. Make sure it's in your hand. One, two, three squirts. It's out, perfect. Make sure it's good. Just got everything good. Right. Now that you did that, take all the hot water, put it inside. Fill it up as much as you need. Shake it, shake it, shake it. All right, all right. Now that you did that, the last little step you're gonna do is pour a little bit inside. Before you do that, before you do that, make sure when you do that, you put your bathtub that the water doesn't drain, like if you were taking a shower. So you would take this and you would put some inside. All right, I think I put enough inside. So after you do that, if you did all the steps, put on the water, get ready for your soapy bath.